Hey everyone, I'm Ultima456 of the Ultimates, and welcome to episode 79 of Less Platinum Horizon Zero Dawn. Alright, so since I was gone, I actually just ran over to, uh, uh, one sec, to this campfire here, and when I turned the game back on, I realized there was a quest here, so I'm gonna run up to this one and get this quest. Hopefully it doesn't start a whole, <laughs> like, uh, I must you know. Advise you against visiting Sunfall. You again. Is this Sunfall? The powers that ordered your death believe they were successful. If you reveal yourself to their agents in Sunfall, your escape will have been for nothing. Well, that's certainly ominous. It is Sunfall. Hmm. Alright, well... I'm a bit confused in that case, but let's talk to this... Not, not you. You? She's very pale. Is she unwell? Yes. She's a fighter, but the fever on her won't lift. It only burns hotter. Her name is Shiana. My sister. Isn't there anyone in Sunfall who can help? We're refugees. We know our place. And there's only one healer in the territory. He's difficult. His soul is in shadow. His soul is in shadow? Galif. That's him. He's very clever, but he has little care for people. Perhaps the desert scoured it all away. Perhaps he was always like that. Either way, I know he won't help us. Well, I'll see about that. Where would I find him? Last I heard, he was patching up soldiers at Blazon Arch. Another border battle. Healer's Oath. Okay. Talk to Gleave and ask him to help Shiana. Alright, where is this? Oh, fantastic. Go all the way back down here. Uh, not right now. So, alright, so I'm supposed to stay out of there, so I guess I'll heed that information. Let's head up here to the Vantage. Stay up here, but I'm pretty sure it's up there. Alright, so how do I climb up that? There's a rope that leads down. There's another rope that leads down. How the hell do I get up there then? Um, just scanning the environment, trying to work out how to get up there. Let's have a look. Hmm, I guess it could be on the other side. I don't know what all this is. Yeah, I see the vantage on this side, but I can't reach it. Oh, hang on, is that what I think it is? Maybe, maybe not. No, it doesn't look like it is. Damn, that sucks. Uh, I'll just climb here real quick and see if I can find a way to get up. Oh. No, not that one. Damn it, that hurt. <laughs> Actually, it didn't. Come on. <laughs> A little dance she does. Never gets old. Uh, okay. Up here. I am close. Yeah, yeah, looks like I can just leap up here. Alright, that wasn't... That definitely wasn't the way to get up here, but... Looks like it worked. And if I can just figure out how to get up to the top. All done. <laughs> uh, where is it? Here? Hey, there it is. What are you guys doing here? Oh, wait. Strike from above. What? Silent strike. <laughs> that was lucky. Okay, and some more metal shards. I wonder... Hang on, let me have a quick peek here just before I get it. Okay, yeah, it was on this side. Alright. Fair enough. Uh, let's get the Vantage and the little supply crate. Found a Vantage. Need to piece the messages together. Okay, that's a lot of good stuff. Four resource supply boxes. Wow, that was rare. No, enough with the Ridgewood. <laughs> too many. 
Alright, uh there we go. Day twelve. As we watch the booster arc up into the night sky, riding a pillar of flame, you took my hand, squeezed it, and said, You have written the story of our family across the stars. Okay. Um now this metal flower. Alright. Oh actually. Let's get this campfire here. Always good to get campfires. They uh assist with fast travel. Because you never know if you need to go back to a place. So that's that one. And now let's do the metal flower. Uh okay, it's telling me it's up there, so maybe a better idea would have been to stay up here. Can I actually get around this mountain though? This could be a problem. Hang on a sec. Ah, nearly. Come on, run. Seriously? Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, so that's not gonna work. What about over here? There we go. This might actually be quicker running across the mountain. Here we go. Found it already. It's got to be this, right? Climb. How long would it have taken? This is not procedurally generated, so it would have taken a very long time to create this world. I think in that case, arguably, uh, procedurally, procedurally generated content might actually be easier to Craft. You only have to craft like a a template and then just repeat it over and over again in different ways. Okay, I'm hoping that it's up here. It's telling me it's a little bit more to the right, but I don't think so. I think it'll be up here. There we go. Is that the last one? Yeah, this is the last one, isn't it? 30. So this will give me the all metal flowers found. Awesome. So, what have we got left? We have some ancient vessels, we've got this bandit camp. Three ancient vessels and a vantage, is that everything? Let's make sure. Three ancient vessels and two vantages. Where's the other one? Oh crap. Uh, wait, wait, we can figure this out. We can go options. Why is vantage not there? Collectibles. Ah, oh, man, up here. Crap, <laughs> that's really annoying. But, campfire? Ah, uh, okay, it's not that far. Alright, not too bad. There you go, that's one really good use for filter options. I like that they put it into the game, but it's definitely one of those things that should have been there from the start. Like, I don't, uh, I don't know, I don't like to sort of a nitpick when it comes to that stuff, but it's definitely, you know, certain features that should be just there from the start. They're in, like, older games, so it doesn't make sense to not have them in, in newer games. And I know that it's it's probably a priority thing, like, they've got, like, a project manager and, or maybe several project managers, and they're like, alright, what do we need to focus on to make sure that this game turns out good? And it's like, a filter option and the map is like the last thing on their minds but uh yeah and i guess technically it only really saved me what like a few seconds just if i had continued looking i probably would have eventually found it is there a nearby campfire so there's that one there's probably one up here i'll just keep following the road uh we need to clear out the bandit camp which i think is that over there and get the vent uh, and get the vessel. Jeez, I'm just remembering how long it took me to find the first ancient vessel. <laughs> uh, oh, there's another quest over there, and also, what did I want to see? Rat bone, raccoon skin, rat bone, raccoon skin. Can I still make the... How do I turn it into a... yeah, create job. Job already exists. Job already exists. Oh. Ok, 
Okay, so now what do I need? Boar? Oh, I do need a boar skin. Boar skin, goose skin, turkey skin. Uh, rat bone, raccoon skin, rat bone, raccoon skin. Alright, so boar. Actually. Yes. I think I got it. I didn't get it. <laughs> Crap. Alright, are there any other animals that are worthwhile around here? Rabbits. Uh, foxes, rabbits, more rabbits. Oh, that is a rat. I wasn't 100% sure if it was, but <laughs> apparently it is. Oops. Seriously? Oh, that's why. It was... the elevation was wrong. Uh, come on, more rats, more rats. Rabbits. Don't need rabbits currently. I mean, I might eventually, but... Okay, and it looks like, from what I can tell, I am going to need to clear out the, uh, what's going on with that guy? Clear out the bandit camp in order to, to get the ancient vessel, so let's go ahead and start doing that. I don't see this guy being... Let's make sure that they die. Okay, no more sneaking. Fighting time. Oh, crap. Didn't see you. Oh crap. Okay, good. Dead. I'm gonna just try and clear out as many of these as possible. Oh, that's a hard shot. Come on, come on. It'll probably get stuck in the thing. Oh yeah. That's what I like. <laughs> Good. You know what? It'll actually help me to work out where all of you are. I don't see them killing me this time. Oh, the alarm. I've got the alarm. Silly me. The alarm is the worst thing. <laughs> But it doesn't look like they are concerned enough to use the alarm currently. Alright, cool. I've got a whole bunch of them. In fact, let me just switch this. <laughs> don't like having that boar skin there. Seems silly. Nice. Pow. Really? That was a headshot? I'm, I'm like I meant it to be a headshot, it was just that the curve felt like it was not very headshot esque, maybe. <laughs> Boom, baby. Alright, good. You've lost interest. No, I haven't. What's this? Ah, oh, drop something green. Um, alright, so we need to actually get over to that alarm, and there are several... There are several enemies in that location, so I've got to be very cautious. No, don't run. Where is it, anyway? Oh, it's just here. There's the alarm. Better keep an eye on it. We got prowlers, friends. Come on. Jeez, man, right under it, on a specific side. They won't be setting what the hell? Ah, oh, that's the that's the vessel. Eyes up, eyes hard. I would like to uh, free those guys. Is there a little? All right, someone saw me. There's people in those cages. Grab it now. I'm not leaving. Free. I don't know if freeing these prisoners does anything, but 
Let's get um, you there. It might give me like more experience or something. Which is not super important, but I guess since I do need to eventually get to level 50, I may as well try and do everything in my power to get it, just in case, you know, I am short at the end. get up there. Probably over here. Careful. Careful. Let's get rid of you first. Eh, too far. The formation is odd there. Nice. I also like to probably examine the area. Collect everything I possibly. Oh god, you guys scared me quite a lot. Uh, hmm, this is a tricky jump, but I'll try it. Okay, got it. Oh, hello. Good. Nice. I'm okay with that. Wow, that guy had a lot of stuff. Yeah, definitely worthwhile to... That nearly oh no. Me. <laughs> that nearly skewered me. Oh my god. Seriously? Take that. Stop blocking. Okay, good. It wasn't pretty, but it worked out. Now, where are the other two? There and there. All right, I'm gonna try and clear, kill this guy real quick. Oh, sorry. Nope, that is the uh, that is the alarm. All right, let's see if I can. Can't mark them, but I can have a quick look. Just want to see if I forgot anything. Ancient debris. Ancient debris. The boar over there. that. Jeez, there's a bunch of supply crates down there. And that one. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here. Get the ancient debris. That's the other one over there. And then I'll uh, try and get inside to um, use all those, like, get all that supply crate stuff. And then finish the bandits off. I'm not exactly sure where the entrance is, but I assume they'll be on one on both sides. Now yeah, we're doing for time, nice. I hope this is the last bandit camp. I'm pretty sure it is, but I also hope it is. Okay, so we'll kill you. Oh no. Good. That's interesting. I didn't hold the, uh, the bow all the way back before I fired and it still did the same amount of damage. And yet, every other point in the game they've made it a point to say that that would not be the case. Okay, he's not looking. Oh, he was not looking for a second. How do we get in there? Here. Oh, wow. Yep, definitely here. <laughs> Alright, see if I can quickly grab all this stuff. So some shards. Lots of stuff to sell. Again. Something I left in there, apparently. Oh yeah, I don't care about that. <laughs> How do the, do the prisoners not get spotted? No, I wanted to get there quickly. Alright, and that should be it. I hope, for all the band caps. There might be one more. I'm thinking now, there might be one more at the top. Unless it just gives it to me after this. New side quest. Cause for concern, farewell. Let's have a little peek. Uh, no, I thought that that would be the last one. What about, um... Ah, oh, <laughs> of course. <laughs> I hate when that happens. Uh, that happened on one of the other trophies as well. It, uh... What was it? Seven... 
types of machine I've ridden, something like that. It wasn't too long ago, but for some reason, okay, good. Oh, Neil. Okay. Um, for some reason, it didn't show the uh, the the image for the trophy, so I'm not really sure what's what happened there. Uh, let's fill up on these, I guess. Oh my god, my wire is low. Alright, good. Don't have to use wire for these. What the hell? Arguably the full health potion is actually easier to make than the health potion. <laughs> um, okay, so I do need to sell a whole bunch of stuff. Um, so I want to sell all this. Uh, I don't think... Oh yeah, I want to sell all these. This one. Two of these. The rest I can keep. Uh, then I want to sell... All of these. Australia lands, watch lands. Okay, so two of these. Two of these. 24 of these. Oops. Um, four of those. Sell it. Sell it. Sell it. Blaze can be kept. Chill water, we can get rid of this. I wonder what the max amount of uh, metal shards you can have is. <laughs> Like, can you farm a million if you really wanted to? And I get rid of tiny meat. I think tiny meat, the only useful thing tiny meat... I think the only thing that tiny meat is used for, is what I meant to say, is for trading for, like, one of those boxes or something in, um... in Meridian, but it's not going to be that useful. Some of these are so good. Um, alright. So I'll leave it like that. How much are we on now? Good. What about resources? 81 is still high, but oh well. That one, 6,500. We've got two skill points. Quests, cause for concern. We will do that right now since it's right there. And notebook collectible. Oh, that was the last ancient vessel I needed So for that set. So I need two more. And the vantages. Alright, let's have a look at Neil real quick over here. It's strange because it... I just got this side quest, and yet it's called Farewell. And does it have a reward? It's just 5,000 experience, apparently. Make those, make those. Oh man, more stuff that I didn't need. And of course, yep, thought so. Health potion. Uh, I missed him by accident. It's alright. Alright, now. Ooh, nice yellow, orangey glow on my screen. Oh, come on. There we go. Neil, what have you have to, have to say? Like a smile with bloody teeth. <laughs> it's almost matter? literally bittersweet. Disappointed. Oh, the bandit clans are gone. I hear another turned back at the southern plains. Just at a sniff of the legend we carved. That's what all this bloodshed was for. To end the bandit threat. But now there's nothing left to kill. Unless... No, no. I guess this is our last farewell. After all we've been through, this isn't the place for that. There's a mesa south of Meridian with a view of the spear shafts. Meet me there. Hmm. Why? Why do you want me to meet you there? Jeez, man. That's very far away, but luckily there's a campfire precisely where that is. Speaking of campfires, let's grab that one and perhaps that one too. Um, and then we're pretty much done. I just want to actually check one thing, because there was something... Hmm, I'm not quite sure how you do it. Maybe it's in settings? Yeah. So they added this in as well, show headpiece. Toggle whether the headpiece is shown when wearing an outfit with a headpiece. So like I have one. If I toggle it off, it it's she's not wearing it anymore. So yeah, that's something. I actually don't like the way it looks, but for the sake of consistency, I'm gonna keep it on. There we go. Um Okay, actually I I can't tell which one's closer. Let's just go over here. Oh wow, they're both nowhere near 50 meters. Uh, no, wait, fox, rabbit. What's that one over there? Watcher. I don't need the 
boar, I'm pretty sure. Rabbit. Boar, boar. I want to get more of those. Come on. And there. And I want to go to this one. And then we'll call it a day. <laughs> I love that. I wonder if that would be a glitch if you um, jump, hold L2 to aim your bow, and then because you're like falling slowly, it wouldn't like. So, say you jumped like from a very high point and held L2, would it slow your descent to the point of uh, where it would reduce damage eventually? That'd be interesting. Uh, okay, I'm gonna fast travel here um, next episode. Oh, well, I'll do it off screen. And then we will continue from there. Alright, perfect there. Um, Alright, so I want to thank you all for watching episode 79 of Let's Platinum Horizon Zero Dawn. My name is Ultima456, you're the Ultimates, and I'll see you next time.